Elise? Monsieur Mirabeau? Elise? Elise? What is this? I found him like this. I didn't. Of course not. But I have to report this to the council immediately. They'll know what to do. No! They don't trust me as it is. I'll be their suspect, first and last. You're right. Of course you're right. What are we going to do? We find out what happened. Handkerchief. Ladies' handkerchief. So, we can count half the noble women of Paris as suspects, then? Maybe one of the staff will recognize it. Poison. Let me see that. Aconite. Hard to detect unless you know what you're looking for. Popular with Templars, is it? With anyone who wants to get away with murder. But yes. Looks like he was expecting a visitor. Who? Master Kama. Doesn't look like it was forced. So the killer was expected? A guest, perhaps? Or a servant? What is that? It's the weapon that killed your father. That's a Templar badge of office. What's it doing here? Painting a picture. Templar poison, Templar pin, it looks damning. Bravo, you figured it out. My cunning plan was to murder the only assassin who doesn't want to see me dead, then stand about waiting to be discovered. Not the only assassin. You're right, I'm sorry. But you know this wasn't my doing. I believe you, the Brotherhood though. Then let's find the real killer before they get wind of this. Alright, Kunjer, and this is the second member in Second 7, meeting with Mirabeau. So, we have just investigated the crime scene, and um, we are going to speak with Kamar. I don't know why I accused her, I just pressed on it, because it said something about her. I didn't just want to leave, the, leave it there. Um, I'll do the same with Master Kamar, so whatever. Doesn't do affect the game anything. But, here we are, we just have to enter the assassin's uh, hideout. And he's up here, and we are gonna talk to him to find out what he knows about this. Because apparently he has nothing to do with it either, I think. But he's standing right there, so we'll get to that later. Ah, Monsieur Dorian. What can I do for you? Mirabeau is dead. Dead? Murdered. 
I knew this truce would come to a bad end. I'll have to summon the rest of the council to deal with this. Elise had nothing to do with it. I'll stake my life on that fact. Please, give me a little more time. I'll find the killer. Very well. You have until tomorrow morning. No later. Mirabeau was poisoned with aconite. Poison? Do I need to point out that that particular strain is a favorite of the Templars? You do not. Where might one acquire aconite in such strong concentrations? Any doctor could prescribe it in diluted form. I myself take a tincture of aconite from my heart. It's strictly regulated, of course, but I do know of an apothecary in Le Marais who is willing to overlook such petty legal matters. Thank you. Well, you had access to Mirabeau. You've disagreed with him publicly on many occasions, and you plainly know how to kill a man. I also have gout so severe I cannot climb stairs some days, and my eyes grow dimmer with every passing week. To say nothing of the dozen or more brother assassins who can vouch for the fact that I've been here since dawn. Forgive me, I didn't mean to imply. No, I didn't. And now we have to speak with them. Um... Speak to an apothecary, which he pointed out, and we knew exactly where he is. First, we have to get out of here. Then we can get over there. Um, there's two optional, just two challenges. Uh, when we get there, so there's almost 300 meters there. But when we get there, we will be chasing him, and there will be two challenges. One of them is the most difficult one, because um, we have to, while chasing chasing him, we have to go on one of the lifts that uh, you like cut the rope and drags you up in the air. We have to do one of those while chasing him, and we have to do that before we get to the pot we're going, where we're going to tackle him because you can't catch up with him before you get there but when you get there he'll just run in circles so uh, but, there, but there's no lifts there nearby so you have to do it before you get there although the second uh, challenge is to climb or uh, climb over or uh, go under obstacles five of them but that that you can actually do when you get to the park. So it's quite what is it to do that? Bonsoir. I wonder Shit. if you might help. Not again. Well played. Wait. Damn you! Come back here. Slow down. Wait. Now the chase has started. You have to tackle him. And this is the first challenge. And pass over under objects. It's still five already. And um, this one lifts used. We have to do. And let's see. Just have a few questions. It's easy to run with this one. He's throwing smokes because you can see through it. Let's see, I think there might be. Yeah, there's a lift right here, but he's running the opposite way, so it would have been dumb to go on that one. And here, some more smoke. There is um, this one. I go, I go over. There's yeah. There's a lift right here. I didn't see that one until I like. Oh shit! There's one there when I went through the window. But whatever. There will be one more. But you can do that one and uh, jump on roofs. But there is one. But yeah, there's a room right there. You just do that. Then you can just run on top of the roof. And I have four or five objects, uh, objects run over or under. And you can't get too far away from him either, so you have to do it kind of quickly. But in here you can jump over benches, uh, which people are not sitting on. I tried to put that those people already sit on, kind of do that. Stupid. But I will jump over the other one and uh, tackle him, so the mission will be completed.
as soon as I get him. So, I'll see you guys later. Bye bye. Please! I never told anyone! I did just as you said! What are you talking about? You, you're with the other one, aren't you? The hooded man! Tell me about this other one. Who is he? I don't know! I never saw his face! Ah! He threatened to kill me if I didn't give him the poison! I didn't ask questions! Ah, I keep only a small quantity in stock! He took that straight away, but he told me... ...where to drop off the second dose! Second dose? Here! That's all I know! I swear it! Ah! Go on, then. Think of this as a wonderful story to frighten your grandchildren with. Well? You were right. He gave our mysterious killer the poison. And he said the killer wore a hood like mine. Well, there are shades of grey in every good story. If we've been betrayed from within... That would explain why the killer tried to frame me. Here. This is where the apothecary delivered his wares. What are we waiting for? 